Yo, yo, Captain Rungulius here, and you are watching Wrench Feels Like Playing Underspace, the adventures of Captain Rungulius. Yeah, we're gonna go on and continue the journey here. Um, we got outfitted with a nice ship the last time we were playing here. We did a couple of freight runs, ended up uh, leveling up to level 13, uh, as well as eventually finding our way to the mysterious gate and jumping in between the uh, space in between. Um, it was like a space in between time and space. It was kind of crazy. Um, we ended up meeting Pyrona, who was stuck there um, in a ship that was broken down, and we managed to uh, rescue her. Um, with uh, There was a couple of drones that were as in that space as well that were aggressive against us and we had to defend against them as well as a battleship drone ship that we had managed to blow up um, as well as uh, we ended up leaving that place rescuing Pyrona and she gave us um, a bit of equipment and some money so that was that was nice of her and uh, we're gonna continue with our story here after after all of that uh, we're gonna just do a couple of missions here under the chapter house of the Idol Smashers. Currently, right now, they want us to go back to Planet Valdric and talk to the uh, chapter house headmaster, Hat. Um, I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just going to do a couple of a uh, couple of bar missions here. We're currently at uh, the Ezer Academy station. I'm just going to do a couple of academy missions right now. Hopefully. Uh, we can manage to hunt down and kill some washers, is which is what I need. Okay, perfectly. So I'm gonna go and do this mission, assassination, hunt down and kill, for the Volodwin military for uh, 28k. It's not not a whole lot, but it's it's the most that they're offering right now, and it kind of is doing what exactly what I want. Uh, I need to kill three washers for the Idol Smashers to uh, progress with the uh, within the chapter. So. This mission drives perfectly with what I need, so we're going to do this one. So we've gotten a word that uh, Kleep Uni, one of the highest ranking members of the Washers, has recently arrived in the system. Kleep Uni has been one of the top and most wanted lists for years, and we can't let this opportunity pass us by. We believe members of the Haskar industry may know their whereabouts. You're cleared to use any technique you deem necessary to find and eliminate your target. So it's just one guy we're looking for. Maybe I'm hoping that there is a couple of them with him. But uh, we're going to accept this mission. And uh, we need to take a look at some Pascar industri industrial ships and see if they know anything about uh, Leap's location. Launch ports are open. Kill the storm and have a nice day. So let's take a look. Okay, perfect. We have some guys right here. So we're going to just go ahead and hail them. What is it? Uh, tell me where Klupuni is. Okay, okay. I'm working everything we're hiding out. Just don't hurt me. I was going to hurt you. I just needed to know. Thank you. All right. So now that we ravagely interrogated one of these traders, we're gonna go and find this guy. Uh, let's take a look on the map. Uh, the local map. Okay, so it is fairly close. We don't gonna need to use a jump gate. And head straight there. We're currently flying the Dozer freighter ship. I uh, I really like the look of this ship, and it's a fairly decent ship to uh, start off with. Um, the JF2 Dozer Junk Tech Freighter. It's a uh, fairly bulky. It's fairly slow, but at the same time, it's actually very controllable and tanky. So it kind of kind of works out for early on here. I still don't have the best guns on it. Okay, so it's just the one guy. Kind of sucks. I kind of wanted to face a couple of washers here, but 
here we go. We're gonna take down this guy. He's a skull guy, so he has a uh, some sort of special moves or some sort of special abilities. We'll see. We'll see about that. Kind of looks like we'll we'll take him down no problem. He's dropping a bunch of mines. Just gotta watch out for that. Whoa. He's dropping his mines like crazy. Holy shit, dude. He's dropping mines like crazy. I've never seen that before. Holy crap. He just made like a minefield. But, you know, uh, we'll just avoid that and take him out. We did. Got 28k right there. Unstable roof fabricator. Holy shit, dude. That dude like made a whole ass minefield. Glad we got out of it. All right, there we go. There's one washer down. We might encounter some washers on the way back. We might move on to a different system, maybe a different uh, station, just to kill some washers here and then uh, head back to Planet Valdrick and kind of check in with the chapter house. I'm not too sure. I don't think we're going to continue with the, the main quest. We'll just kind of continue on just with the chapter house missions. After that, I'm hoping to maybe jump on with the uh, the Veil Drakes maybe and do some storm chasing. That's something I haven't yet really done in this game, which has done a whole lot of storm chasing and it's kind of a big part of the game. So very interested in doing it and you kind of have to do a bunch of storm chasing to get a bunch of storm eyes to upgrade your ships so just kind of one of those things where kind of need to do it eventually so okay so let's go back to we're gonna dock on the battleship and see if they have any cool missions battleship Caldran. Perfect. Thank you, Battleship Caldron. Commencing docking. Like a glue. All right, so. What do they have on the draw board here? So they got another assassination mission for uh, 24k structure demolition compromised data strange signals part of our defense efforts so the Draldric expanse involves making sure early warning systems are functional and eliminating anomalies related to that our comm systems have been picking up strange signals at specific coordinates. We need a star chaser to investigate that they are eliminated any rogue elements, if that's the case. Uh, let's take it up. It's only 14k, but let's take a look and see what this guy's what this this one's all about. You are clear to launch. Good luck out there. I have another mission where we don't really necessarily have to use any jump gates. Just kind of got to fly there. We're still using the uh, very early mission uh, guns and stuff here. We do have a web eater. We have, we got in a web eater from Pyrona, which was super nice. We got two of them. I'd say a web eater is the very you're going to want to get a web eater the very first thing as soon as you can. It's the first shield killer that you're going to come across. You're only going to need one of them. But, uh, because they drain your energy really quickly. But in order to get shield just down super quick, you're going to need a web eater. 
It looks like we got some washers. Perfect. Let's take on some washers here. Shipping Lascar. You're going down, buddy. Completely missed. Man, when they're in a group, it's kind of hard to figure out who you're actually aiming for. I got this. No problem. Come on. rank up in the chapter house. Awesome. There we go. I'll uh, head back to Valdrick and uh, get my rewards for that. need some better guns here and some better aim Take a look. We got uh, Cat One Storm going on. We're looking for now. I need to kill. No, we just gotta go to the chapter house. I believe you have to kill like 35 washers next. So it's uh, quite quite a bit off of uh, 
what we have right now. But if we do a couple more missions, I think we might actually try and uh, level up to the second level of uh, Idol Smashers Chapter House. Kill 35 Washers. I don't think that's far out there to uh, do. We just killed five of them right there. But we're going to actually head to a jump gate. Back to Planet Valdric. No one's matched for Captain Regulius. class 2 web eater and a bunch of class 0 or class 1 sunbeams that we're definitely going to need to upgrade here. We currently only have 91k which really isn't a whole lot to upgrade guns just yet. But uh, looking to change that here with a couple of missions. These missions in the this system aren't the most expensive. Might have to move on to Baldwin space and do a couple Baldwin military missions rather than the Baldwin Miller military. The only problem is I don't know if I face washers out in, in Baldwin space. Or Baldwin space, sorry. Fuck on Valdric. Doc. Go ahead to the chapter house. Take a look at the chapter page. We're gonna go to chapters and idol smashers, and we're gonna go claim rewards. We picked up two love two guns, and then the next upgrade is 45 washers. We have killed six. The next upgrades are 45 washers. Damn, son. So we're ranked two of the idol smashers. We're going to continue on with the Idol Smashers. Um, I'm not going to continue go and do the mission, the main story mission right now. I'm not really not really interested in that right now. We're going to create our own path here as Captain Rangulius, not as Cardaw Speakerson. Um, so we are going to go ahead and go to the equipment dealer. And see what our guns look like here then we just got the love two guns here they shoot at 8.33 so they're fast they do 84 fall damage and 44 shield damage what do our class they are class four weapons so they're probably going to be better than our sunbeams currently they are way better than our sunbeams so we're gonna sell Two of our class zero sunbeams, or our class one sunbeams. Equip both of our love guns here, love twos. So equip that and equip that. We got two guns that we can use right now that we don't have to spend money on. They're not gonna be our permanent guns, but they're better than the ones we had. And then now we have a puncture MK3 as well which does 120 hull damage, 60 shields at four per second. We might mount that as well. This is a class three weapon, so there's no reason we can't mount it. So I'm actually gonna sell our last Class one sunbeam. 
and we're going to equip this puncture mk3 for now we're probably going to end up swapping these out fairly quickly as soon as we get some real money here but not right now and then we have a web eater here that we are just chilling with we might put it on a different ship so i should probably put that in like my cargo bay Looks like we got a bone sunder missile. Oh, those are, that's ammo. So we have 91k. I'm not really. I'll just wait until I have enough money to actually buy the best one. Everything's fairly expensive. Everything costs like over 100k, 150k. When you want to really want to buy the really good stuff, it's they're all over like a million stuff, and some of them cost like storm eyes as well as money. So I need to start really clearing some storm clouds, getting some storm eyes. I think if you clear higher category storms, you probably get more storm eyes. I could be wrong with that. I haven't cleared anything other than a cat one storm, I believe. So we'll see. We'll eventually do some storm hunting for sure. That's I definitely want to do that. I want to uh, I want to get the uh, higher tier ships. See how those play. Okay. So that should be good for now. I do believe I have stuff in my. So if I go to crafting here, yeah, I have stuff I need to fix here. So I got a bone sunder or a puncture MK3. It takes. Okay, so I lost something there as well. It takes 30 seconds to fix it. It's kind of kind of annoying, but okay. Um. And there's a couple other things here that looks like we can fix. But it does look like it costs stuff to fix. So if we go to like extra hole plating here. Uh, a broken item, large thruster. So if I go craft item, do I lose more than just one thing here? Lost unstable refabricator. So it costs one of those things in order to fix something. Unstable refrigerator. I don't think I have too many of those. I think I got a couple from Car uh, from Carbell. Okay, so we got a large thruster now. Got another one of those MK3 guns. If I go to like special, okay. It's all crafting. This whole plating, large thruster. I guess I got a couple of these broken thrusters here. It seems. And I have. How many? I guess I have two more unstable refabricators. It seems. I would need an Alandine repair kit or an Al Alanine, Alanine to fix the bones under launcher here. I wish you could just sell this stuff. You can't sell it, so it's kind of just sitting in my inventory. Valuable. 50k. Unstable refabricator. I need three of them. Oh shit. I could have sold that for quite a bit of money. Shit. Okay. So you get unstable refabricators from like looting broken ships and stuff. Can't really buy it from places, I don't think. Could be wrong with that. So I got a couple of things in my inventory that could sell for very for 50k a piece. That's not bad. 
And then we're going to go and sell this gun. So we're going to go weapons, puncture, MK2, or MK3, class 3 weapon. It's not the greatest. We're going to just sell it. So now we have 123k. How much was the um, shaft here? Hundred thirty, just can't buy it. What about hundred fifty? So the engine suite, engine tuning kit. This is a large scale series of engine software executables all designed to run next to one another and allow for greater efficiency for all aspects of engine acceleration multiplier 1.2 times cruiser time decrease 1.2 times abyssal drive knockdown decrease one times and then the drive charger is one where it takes longer to i don't want to i don't want this one i'm just going to take the engine suite for now for 60k And uh, move on from there. We're also going to restock. Rearm ship for 800 bucks. And then we can go to the bar. And see if there's any good missions here. I don't think there is. Attack on countermeasures. We've had reports of the washers preparing a massive assault force. And one of our contacts leaked their rendezvous point. We need you to get out there to where their coordinates will provide and make sure the washer ships don't survive. We won't be facing alone, however, as we have a fighter patrol on the standby to assist you. Good luck. 28k. Uh, well, that's actually not too bad. Difficulty 11. Doesn't really pay out the greatest, but definitely has washers there. There's this other mission here, the uh, enemy base elimination. Several older members of the Mata have established a storm buoy too close for comfort. We want you to get out there and destroy it before it becomes a bigger problem and leads to civilian panic. Any fighters or ships can be ignored. The structure is that matters. This is a Mata mission. I'm actually not going to take that. I'm going to go with the attack countermeasures and go destroy some of these uh, washer ships and kind of continue on with our uh, idle smasher goals of 45 washer kills. I kind of want to see what that pays out. I haven't uh, gotten further with a chapter house before, so I kind of want to see where uh, getting higher levels with certain chapters will, will get you. I'm assuming that I get rewarded higher guns, obviously, better equipment, and then possibly ships, I, I've heard. Like, I've gotten ships out of the main story missions before, so I'm hoping maybe you get... Kind of, they made it seem like you also could get ships for chapter house missions as well. Could be wrong. That would be freaking sweet. We're gonna on a head on out to the mission waypoint here. Just sitting right behind Planet Valdwick. Got a couple new guns to test out. The Love 2s. Approaching. Approaching waypoint. Oh, 
Bogey's in sight. Labwin chump. The shields are down. Body's down halfway. Come on, let's go. Got him. You did. Looks like we got a skull guy here, it looks like, maybe? We got a sparkly guy. Shields down. Got him. Whoa. My shields got down. Bear shields. You just knocked my shields real quick. You did. Is that it? Push my point. We lose some of them. Are these bogeys on the way or what? Uh-oh. We glitch this out. Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh man. Oh man. Yeah, I think they're squished out here. Well, that sucks. been there you can mine that area we're not gonna head there this kind of sucks man I kind of wanted to do the mission here we did it and it almost seemed like something else blew up the last ship there and then it didn't count for us yeah I don't really know what's going on that kind of sucks we're just gonna have to abandon this mission I guess That's bullshit. That's bullshit. I don't get paid for that. Wasting my motherfucking time. And we lose a little bit of rep for that too. Our rep's good enough where it doesn't really matter, but still. Just because the game glitched out, I lose some rep. I think that was the military. Uh, maybe it balances out with the ones I've already completed. I was pretty sure that you lose rep when you uh, cancel missions. I think we are going to go and head out to Baldwin, our uh, Baldwin space here. Don't know how many washers are really in Baldwin space, though. That's kind of my worry. Just kind of why I wanted to... You know, what? you know what? Yeah. We're gonna actually stay in, uh, Valdwick space here. Let's do a couple more missions here. I just hope that, uh, I don't get too much missions, uh, Roger that. not working here. Proceed to dock number two. Again, it's Storm Eye. Attention detected ships. This is Agonization 2. The fuck? We're on our scanners requesting 
identification. I wonder if that's a late glitch thing for that guy dying. Because that guy, the last washer that I was going to have to face looked like he was like a... Looked like to me he was like a special guy where he was like a skull guy who was going to give me a storm eye. And uh, for some reason it glitched out there. I wonder if I had a little bit of patience if I would have completed that mission. Oh well. Oh well. We're going to go to Zebar and look at the job board. Okay, what do we got here? We got a base and elimination mission for the Mata. We got fighter destruction. We've had reports of the washers preparing a massive assault force. And one of our contacts leaked the rendezvous point. We need you to get out the coordinates we provide and make sure that any of the washer ships don't survive. 20k. Baldwin police. Alright. Alright. 20k. How many washers? Didn't really tell me how many washers. You just said a, a massive force, so... 20k doesn't really seem like a whole lot for a massive force. But I'll do it. Washer killing's washer killing. At least we got a storm eye for that. That's not bad. Kind of, kind of weird that the game glitched out there, but that's okay. That's okay. We still got the points for killing, killing washers. Killed eight washers so far. Where's this mission taking me? All the way out here, eh? I always kind of forget to restock, but 14 missiles should be fine. Take me on? I don't think so, bud. Bogey on my six, evading. We ain't evading. Shit. Oh. Got you. Where are you going? I have enemy target in my sight. They won't get away. Oh, got ourselves a freighter. Are you running away? Where are you going? You did. It's on the menu, it's on the menu. Got 
out of here. Oh. Yeah, these love guns are a lot better than the uh, Sunbeam Class 1s. They always try to lure you in and try to get you to get sucked into the damn gates. I don't get, I don't think I get the count for that. That sucks. All right, all right. Let's uh, head on out to the waypoint. Kill some more washers. Let's wash those washers. To the cloud probably just right on the edge of the cloud here I might just head into the cloud and uh, see if I can uh, eliminate this cat one storm get myself another storm eye we'll see Zolmeski Duriosi. Duros. Oh yeah, that's a lot of washers. Damn, I don't even know who I'm aiming at. Damn, when there's so many of them, it's really hard to figure out who you're actually aiming for. Down, shields down. Got him. No, please drop the you did. Down. Damn, son. Some of the colors is just hard to see. Here we go, here we go. You're dead, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead. You're dead. Got him. Boom, bitch. Take that boom, Sunder. Home. You dead. Shield down, shield down. these washers down one by one oh ran into a mine damn got him mission complete what's this living I'll take some of that alrighty so we got some money for that got some washer kills from that let's 
16. Nice. Working our way up. Let's just jump over to Braven Spire Star or Draven Star Spire. It's a junk tech station. I don't think they give very good missions. We'll check it out. All I'm looking for is something to make me kill washers. Roger that. You are clear to dock. Proceed to dock number four. Dock number four. Incoming. Ready to dock. sell the firearms I have in my ship. Go to the bar. Rival tensions. Twenty five K for that one, which is the most, so one of our proclaimed junkyards is being illegally squatted on by a group of criminal scrappers. Obviously, it would be in our best in our in your best interests if you got out there and showed them what that junk Ted does not appreciate unwanted competition. Violence is permitted. After all, they are breaking the law. So they pay out 9k or 25k. Difficulty 9, not really all that difficult. We'll take the mission. Hopefully that these uh hope these these guys are washers. You are clear to launch. Good luck out there. Alright, head on out. Oh, what do we got here? You want some? Washers? I live to kill washers. You think you're just gonna roll up on me? You think you're just gonna roll up on me? You did. Ships. They take offense to that. You did. Well, you shouldn't have uh, attacked Captain Rangulius. That was your stupidity, not mine. Head on out to the mission waypoint. We level up. I think that just means we got a new star mine. Got a bulwark shield, a class one shield. We'll just sell that. We ended up getting a star sunship, sun sunder launcher. It's a class three missile, it's not a class one missile. We might keep this one. Does 19. Oop, shit. There we go. I think we will mount that for sure. I think it probably does more than our Bone Sunder, which is a class one missile. Yeah, come on. 
break up a little bit, guys. Like, I don't even know what I'm shooting at. Come on. Come on. Got shit on me, rival miner. Okay, so these aren't washers, which kind of sucks. Wonder if they're gonna have cargo. You did. Doesn't seem like it. Probably won't do another junk tech mission. I'm more or less interested in fighting washers, not some not some low level miners. Definitely not a fighter. It turns very slowly, but at the same time, like it's not too bad fighting. Uh, not too bad fighting NPCs with the ship. I definitely won't be fighting using this as a uh, PVP ship, but uh, it definitely works for fighting NPCs. If you don't want to have to constantly change up your ships. I'm sure once I get a super freighter, I don't know what a super freighter essentially looks like just yet. I know they're in the game, but I eventually get a super freighter, and I don't know how maneuverable those will be. But for the most part, I'll probably just stick to the freighter class of uh, starships, because they get the job done. Honestly, I like to look at the dozer here. Got him. These guys are actually like criminals and we're not just killing some innocent miners right now. They did attack us first though. Fuck, this is only a 28k mission. Damn. I didn't restock my guns. I don't have that many missiles. Come on. 
blow up. Blow up. Thank you. Damn, like, kind of in trouble here. There's not like it, more waves of this. I really hope this is the last wave of them. I was expecting, was not expecting this many of them. Not there, there, that hard to kill. It's just a lot of them. Big green explosion there. One more guy left. Twenty-five K. Yeah. Probably won't be doing another one of their missions. Now I killed eighteen washers, still need forty-five. Damn, son. That's a lot of washers. That is a lot of washers. Star and then go to Asiris Academy and uh, you are clear to launch. Good luck out there. Take a look at their bar missions again, just kind of see. Looks like the lanes got blocked up right here. I'm not handing over shit. Switching to engage, star chaser, alpha, one. You washer? One. No, you're mad at me. Useless. Useless. You're just a waste of my time. I'm gonna head back home. Got them in my sights. Opening fire. 
If it was washers, I'd stay. You're a waste of my time. The Mata family has nothing on me right now. Maybe later. Go ahead and dock at S here Academy. Man, you are clear to dock. Proceed to dock number one. Yeah. Repair the ship. Restock. Go ahead and go to the equipment dealer and sell some of the stuff we have in our cargo. So the sun or the ship sunder launcher, 1980 hull damage and 495 shield, which I'm it's not really a shield missile. Our missile is 1320. So we're definitely gonna sell our bone sunder and equip the ship sunder hell yeah I don't think I've ever equipped a that class of a missile okay so we're gonna sell this big thruster that we fixed up the bulkward shield, we're not going to use it. It's just a class 1 shield, low level. Sell that. We can sell all our Bone Sunder missiles at this point. We're not going to use them anymore. Going to keep the web eater. We have... 16 or 165,000. They only sell class 4 weapons here, so I'm not going to buy any weapons from this place. We're going to have to definitely move on and uh, go to probably some bald in space, and hopefully, they have some, some washer killing missions. I'm not too sure if. There's washers in Baldwin's base. There probably is. There's also a chapter house in here. The Veil Drakes. So if you join their chapter, you're wanting they want you to claim Chase Three Storms and Ryu Two Survaldric Storms. So we're just gonna stick to the washer killing for now. 36k power balance. Not bad. 40k power balance. 48k power balance. As a highly valued and trusted asset of the Valduin Senate. We'd like to task you. Oh, sweet. Maybe the more you, uh... Build a reputation? How's my reputation right now with them? I thought it's still only like 80... 89%. Yeah, it's still only 89, but... I guess we've killed a lot of their enemies. Completed a couple of their missions. But I don't think I've really gotten any higher than 89% here. But that'd be pretty sweet as long as you kind of continue to uh, do their missions. They maybe provide higher higher tier missions because we're uh, getting a... Uh... Oh, shit. And we just lost them. So it does randomize every time you kind of go back and look at the draw board again. So now we got some higher paying out missions again. So... We can either do some elite power balance missions. There is another assassination mission for 44k. Which I think I'm going to do. It's only one washer, but it's 44k for killing one washer. And he might have a, st or a star eye that comes along with it. So 
We're gonna take down this Hogby Borble dude. One of the highest ranking members of the Washers. Has recently arrived in the system. Most wanted list for years. And we're not gonna pass up this. So all I need to do is take out the target. Can do. Can do. Uh, let's restock. Before I forget, fill up our ship slanders. And let's go. Launch ports are open. Kill the storm and have a nice day. Oh, do I have to talk to someone? Did I miss that part? Did I miss that part? I don't really have a, uh, Speaker Freight may know where the whereabouts, okay. I don't see any Speaker Freight around here. We're gonna have to find a member of the Speaker Freight. See if we can harass them and if they know anything about this Borble dude. Just any old random speaker freight guy. They all know. One of them knows they all know, apparently. So over Planet Valdric, we might find a find one of their ships there. Speaker Freight. Come on. Oh, there we go. Uh oh. Might just miss them. Like you talk, tell me where Orgby Barble is. Okay, okay, I'll mark it on your map. Just don't hurt me. Okay, good. It's just 30k this way, eh? That's convenient. Jaunt over to the waypoint here and take out this Horby guy. Horby be Borble. Test out our ships under your launcher. washers. Just what I wanted. Chungus Sawaba. That's not what I wanted. Sababad. Sababdad. Ah, there's Horgby Bobby Bubble. He needs a skull, so okay. But he's a little bit more dangerous. Apparently. I just knocked his shields, no problem. We're gonna test out our Bone Sunder missile. Taking him down. He's dead. You dead. Paid it out. Awesome. That was easy. That guy was one of the most wanted. And gained a storm eye for it. Oh yeah, baby. That guy was nothing. Haunted. What the fuck? What the fuck? 
What am I fighting? Can I scan? Uh, I don't want to kill it just yet. Yeah. No shit. 50k worth of data. What the fuck is this guy? Haunted. Nothing to pick up. I'm glad I scanned him. Glad I thought of it. Before I ended up killing him. Shit, dude. What the fuck was that? Crazy. I kind of want to take out this storm. I just don't necessarily know... Where? Do I just fly randomly into a cloud and just hope that I run into the storm? I kind of feel like that's weird, right? Like... I just head towards the lightning? Headed into the Baldrick Belt. I'm just curious if this turns into a storm cloud. Am I gonna run into? What I want to run into here. Here's the lightning. Don't necessarily know how to storm chase just yet. From my experience, the storms have been in the nebulas. But right now, I'm not really feeling it. Right now. I hear the lightning, but I don't necessarily feel. necessarily feel like I uh I'm going in any particular direction what is that I got green up there I think green's a gate isn't it sure this red's a broken down ship white's like a station or a planet gold is a expensive like, or like a weird kind of system I'm pretty sure green is a jump gate Right there. That's a jump gate right there. I don't necessarily want to fly through that. Unstable jump hole. I'm getting real close to it though. Someone who doesn't want to fly through it. Last time I did that, 
I got transported across the entire galaxy. Kind of looking for a storm eye here. Not a random jump hole. But, like, this is super intriguing. You know what? We've got our ship. We've got some pretty decent weapons. We've got a loadout. Let's go on an adventure. Let's see what this unstable jump hole brings us. Oh, nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay. Okay. I see how it is. I see how it is. Is it just not gonna work, or what? No? Is that not how this works? Maybe... This is something that I would need to finish the game to do, so I can control these? Maybe that's the case. That's lame. I was expecting to go on an adventure there. What the fuck? Okay. Okay, well. Shit. We are gonna go ahead. I was kind of looking for the uh, center of the storm, but I don't seem to be anywhere near where the storm's happening. It might be over in that nebula over there, that pink one over there, and not the one I'm in current. It's kind of sick. Bolton train yard. Zuhelehe's jump gate. Which one is that exactly before I decide to go that way? I might want to go this way. We're gonna go and explore Zula Haste. To me? Oh, we got a skull washer too. We might get a storm on for this. You want a piece of me? You don't know you're messing with. Don't you know I'm Captain Rangulius? 
You ain't gonna be me. Level 14. Gain the Storm Eye. Hell yeah. Zules. You want a piece of me? You don't know me. You don't know me. Or you wouldn't have tried me. You running away? Nah, -uh, Jatis Papa. I think I killed your cousin. Got him. All right. Let's head on over to the UHC 46, where it all begins. This is where the rookies get trained. Station. We can sell our data to the chapter house. 50k. Hell yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. Oh shit. Don't worry about that. It's just a flesh wound. Okay. So we are going to go to the chapter house. They got the white fleet. They're ghost hunters, which it seems like I faced a ghost ship of some kind or haunted ship. And then the Veildrakes are in this area as well. And the embalmers who hunt artifacts. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Um, I'm going to sell my data. Scan data, 50k, sell that. Oh yeah. Ace enemy, haunted. So, warning. Underspatial energies are detected in mass quantities around this ship. These energy signatures match the same signatures found on ghost ships. It is possible that, upon detection, this ship and its pilot might reform into a far more dangerous hostile entity. Well, we took them down, no problem. So... Got him. 50k, fuck yeah. Ain't nothing to laugh at. And we leveled up as well. 
we might actually take more ammo i'm gonna go three more into ammo and that i think that'll bump us to 20 ammo even oh yeah and there you have it where do we got missions at Looks like there's ooh, there's someone cool at the bar. There's a mission at the bar here. All right. Well, I think that's where we're going to end it today. Uh, we uh, cleared a couple of missions for the Baldwin military, some Baldwin police missions. Did a, even a a junk tech freight mission there, but uh, at the end of the day, all we wanted to do was kill some washers, and we killed some washers. Gain some levels into the Idol Smashers chapter house. Uh, I think we're probably about halfway done killing uh, washers for our little, our next upgrade onto the Idol Smashers ranking. Yeah, we've killed 23 washers. We're about halfway done. So maybe next time we'll upgrade into the chapter house. Until then, peace.